Hey y'all, Gina Brown here to talk a little Bitmoji. I haven't done any Bitmoji videos in a while, so this is a nice little break um, from Canvas. So I have people asking how to get rid of the words in the Bitmoji mask picture. So for example, if you have the Bitmoji Chrome extension, this works the best. If you don't, go to your Chrome store, search it up, add it, it's awesome. So you see right here, if you search the word mask, I know it's right there, but to tell you how to find it, search the word mask or wear your mask actually. So I'm happy I'm doing this. Wear your mask. Wear your mask. There it is. <laughs> okay, so if you have the Bitmoji Chrome extension, you can just pull it and you're good to go. Um, there's no background, but I don't want the wear your mask words on it. So what you're gonna do instead is you are gonna save your Bitmoji however you can. Um, so if I just right click on it, I can hit save image as, and it pops it right down here, which is perfect. Then I'm gonna go to one of my favorite websites, remove.bg, remove background. Um, and this is useful when you're doing your Bitmoji classrooms. Um, I've done this and like remove my background and put a picture of me in the Grand Canyon. Um, so there's a lot of applications. So since there's not a background on this, what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit this edit tool right here. So typically if there was a background, it would be gone and then I can still edit further. So I like to erase and restore. I like to make the button big because I have a lot of room, but you can make the brush size super small, um, which is really good to kind of get in those smaller spaces. So I'm just gonna do this kind of as carefully as I can. And if you mess up, you can just hit that little back button up top and it will go back. I'm gonna keep the heart so like I can hit that if I messed up. And then this bottom part's a little bit trickier because you just kind of want it to look semi-decent so I kind of just brush back and forth to kind of get it but get like an even oh I got rid of my t-shirt oh well okay perfect and then you hit download y'all and that's it so now when I go to my slide I can insert my downloaded image and then I always just try to um kind of save these in a file so I don't have to keep doing this because I'm totally going to need that mask picture again for sure. And there we go. Bing, a bang, a boom. It is done. Um, there's other options, like for instance, if um, you've got a Bitmoji, like I want, I love this one, but I don't like the high. You don't need to do remove.bg for something like this um, because you can just double click and see how this black bar comes, black box, then you can slide it. So like, yeah, it cuts off a teeny bit of my hair but it definitely saves me a step. And then I click off of it and then I have it ready to go. And I can see there's a little spot left. So now I go in and then I can make this smaller. So that way, if I'm stacking stuff up, it's easier, but you have to double click and get the black one. If it's just the blue one, it will distort it. So there you go. So there's two options. If it's more in depth, you kind of need to use the remove.bg. And if it's something quick and easy, you can use this black uh, box version and it's still there. So if you want it for later, it's good to go. And then, yeah, and I just dragged and dropped them over here. So I did the same thing with the wash your hands. I can show you all that one. Um, I'm not going to remove it, but I can show you what it looked like before. So I did the same thing with this one and I removed this one. I used a smaller brush to kind of get in there because I like the bubbles. Um, and then I did the same thing with the uh, wash your face or don't touch <laughs> Wash your face, y'all. <laughs> um, don't touch your face. Yeah, so I did the same thing. I used the um, remove.bg. I mean, you probably could. I probably could have done this also, actually. Um, and it probably would have been okay, but I would have had to, go, had to have gone up a lot higher and lost my elbow. So that's why I did remove BG for that one. Okay, y'all, hope that was helpful.